But let's go ahead and start our eBay breaks. 2017-18 Ascension Basketball. Uh, six box half case break number 32. It is the only uh, eBay break we have for today. So let's go ahead and knock this thing out. What's going on, Jason? How you doing, my man? Hope all is well. Happy Valentine's Day. About one auto per box in this stuff. Great draft class. The first half of this case was decent. Will kids play? Have you checked out our store, my man? Something tells me you don't, because that sounds like a uh, like like you don't know any better because you haven't checked the store. Correct? If you did check the store, well my friend, you would have a surprise. We got some Panini One football in the store. We got some impeccable basketball pre-sale and some select football pre-sale. So kids play for life, take a seat. You have no idea what you're talking about. As usual. I told you we'd have more stuff in the store today, but no. Nobody wants to believe Uncle Jesse. Shame on you, kids play for life. Shame on you. Kids play, uh huh. Let that let that be a lesson to you. You gotta check every day, cause you never know. Jason is sneaky like that. Jason is a sneaky, sneaky guy. Just when you think you have things all figured out, boom! Anyways, kids play for life. Happy Valentine's Day. Have you done anything special for your significant other so far? Oh man, somebody's been playing with my with my settings. Right, let's get this fixed. Dude, is this like an everyday thing? I'm gonna have to do this every single day. I need to figure out what the uh There's gotta be a way for me to save this. Anyway, let's see what we got here. Josh Hart Lakers rookie. Warriors got all kind of feisty last night. They took an L dog to the uh, to the Trailblazers. Trailblazers are a funny team. Some nights they look amazing. Some nights it's like what? I wouldn't mind having uh, that boy Damian Lillard in a Heat uniform. That kid is a beast. And no disrespect to the folks out there in, in Portland. Not exactly a hot destination for free agents. Whereas Miami, I mean, come on, it's Miami. Jonathan Isaac to 129. So hopefully Pat Riley can make some moves this offseason. So we can be uh, back in championship contention. I like what the Dolphins are doing. Dolphins are uh, pretty much picking up expatriate personnel. For our uh, for our rebuilding, so hopefully we can turn things around sooner than later. Dwayne Bacon, 
with the Hornets autograph to 75. Frank Nelikino, the Knicks with the die cut. Dwayne Wade to 125 Bulls. Alrighty. Correct, kids play for life. It'll tell you like, oh, the first wide receiver in the first wide receiver picked in the 2019 draft or something like that. Or at least that's how it was last year. It would tell you like the first wide receiver or the first running back or the first tight end or the first QB, so on and so forth. Kuzma. That Lakers team is in danger of not making the playoffs. Like I said at the beginning of the season, before the season even started, I was telling people, I don't think the Lakers are making the playoffs. And people were calling me crazy. They're the 10th seed right now. Larry Nance Jr., 75. What's up, Doug Eyed? Happy Valentine's Day. I was watching, well, I think it was either, first, no, it was first take. I was watching first take. And uh, they were uh, arguing about it. The Sixers, I'm sorry, the Lakers are like a six, like right now, there's a 6% chance to get into the playoffs. Or I should say they have a 6% chance to get into the playoffs. That's not good. Lonzo Ball, Lakers, autographed the 299. Speaking of the Lakers. What's up, Fitz? How you doing? Happy uh, Valentine's Day. Yeah, he has been out for, for close to 20 games, so that that's definitely a factor. Um, but, you know, it, it doesn't bode well for the young crew. Josh Hart to 129 for the Lakers. You would think that, you know, they have so much talent that they step up. But the best word I can use to describe them, they look like a daisical out there. Like, they kind of just don't care. Especially after the, or, or should say during... The uh, trade deadline there. They were putting like almost no effort. Even LeBron looks like he takes plays off sometimes. Like he's just standing at the top of the three-point line. Not even trying to, you know, get a rebound or, or go for the ball or anything. Oh, snap, Fitz. Yeah, I saw you scooped him up last night. Hopefully we can get that thing popping tonight. What up, Jason? How you doing, bro? How's everything with your player from the Himalayas? Right, right. Did I uh, did I mess up some? Okay, I was about to say. Good 
there was a pretty sweet uh, Correa rookie in there too. All right, Fitz. Happy Valentine's Day. Enjoy yourself. Have a good one, y'all. Now we just got to fill the next case. That's all. Which I don't know where it's at right now. I want to say it's at like 12 or something. There you go, Jason. I mean, listen, if you want to throw me a bone and get a team in the uh, Chrome 115, I, uh, I I definitely won't hold it against you, you know. Just, just say it. That one's actually at 13. So we can probably fill that tonight. Prism, that prism breaks at 15. Plates and patches at 8. So we got some stuff we can work with tonight. Alright, let's see what we got here. We got a KD overdrive die cut for the Warriors. What's today? Thursday? There should be basketball on. On TNT, I believe. The Heat played last night, and we spanked the Warriors. Steph Curry, 125 for the Warriors. We played the Mavericks, I'm, I'm sorry. And we put a spanking on them. Luka Doncic looked like a rookie out there. Could have handled that Heat defense, baby. We do have one of the best defenses in the league. Uh, we just can't score is our problem, in crunch time specifically. With like under three, four minutes to go, Okay, we kind of just play hot potato. We don't have we don't have a true superstar. We have good players. We have solid players. You know, we have players that could be starters on other teams coming off the bench, but we we just don't have a true true superstar. Jonathan Isaac, one twenty nine, uh, one twenty nine magic. So hopefully we can address that in the off season. I really, 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 really want us to go after um, that kid out there in Portland. What's his name? Uh, Lillard, Dame Dalla. Isaiah Thomas uh, came back yesterday from his uh, hip surgery for the for the Nuggets. Had about eight points. He was all right. He was all right. So this should be the autograph right here, I believe. It is for Kevin Durant. Very nice. And it hasn't even expired yet. There you go. That's sweet. Nice, nice, nice hit right there for the Warriors. Matter of fact, let me make sure that it's Warriors. Because I don't want it to be like, oh, it's a throwback. It goes to the Thunder on some random BS. I just want to go ahead and make sure that's correct. In the meantime, let's keep it moving. What is the 1718? Yeah, it should definitely be Warriors, but it doesn't hurt to, tr to check. It never does. I'd rather be certain than anything. Well, what's the same? Better be safe than sorry. I got the checklist up. Durant. Uh, so he saw. Ah, see, it's a good thing I checked. So he does have the base set veteran throwback, which would go to the Sonics, aka the Thunder. That's card ninety-five, which is this one. This is card ninety-five. So this actually goes to the Thunder. Uh, let me make sure of this. Okay. See, now that's strange. Ah, this is the base set auto. Yeah, base set auto. Card 95 Warriors. I'm mistaken. But look, I, w I want you guys to... S I, j I just want you guys to see what I'm looking at so, so you don't think that I'm crazy. Uh, let me put this on the screen here for you. All right, so this is the checklist for it. As you can see, right here, 1718 Ascension Basketball Team Checklist. So this is card 95. You can see it there in the corner, card number 95. The card set is base set autographs. So as you can see here in green, base at auto plus parallels, card number 95 goes to the Warriors. So what I was looking at was this. 
Like I said, it was the base set veteran throwback. Same card number for some reason, which threw me off. But this card goes to the Warriors because it's not the base set veteran throwback. It's the base set auto, all right? So that indeed does go to the Warriors, as you can see right there in the checklist on the screen. All right, so before the Thunder owner gets mad at me, It is what it is. There you go. All right, cool. So that's pretty sweet. Warriors picking up a KD auto. This case was pretty good, man. The other half of this, if I'm not mistaken, had a Kuzma, a Donovan Mitchell, a Laurie Markkinen. It was it was ridiculous. And in this half, there's Alonzo, the KD. And we're only halfway. So let's see what's in the rest of this stuff. Nature is calling, but I'm gonna answer later. All right, let's see what we got here. To one twenty nine, what she won't do magic. They should trade Vucevic, man. That guy's a baller. We need to get him out of there, the Magic. That, that team is going nowhere. They've had top picks in like the last three straight years, and no one has really ascended to like, oh, snap, he could be a star. I think Mo Bamba is going to be good, but he's still really young. A good auto right here. Malik Monk to 299 for the Hornets. Uh, they will be hosting the All-Star game this weekend. Uh, All-Star festivities start tomorrow. I think tomorrow is the uh, the celebrity game and the skills challenge or something like that. Or no, I lied. I think tomorrow is just the straight up... Uh, I, don't, I need to check it out, man, because they, they, they switched up the, the way they do the All-Star game. Chandler Parsons, 125 Grizzlies. It used to be where Friday would be like the skills challenge... And, and all that good stuff. Actually, I lied. No. Friday was like the rookie, the rookie sophomore game. And like the celebrity game, too. Saturday would be the skills challenge, the three point shootout, and the dunk contest. And then Sunday would be the actual All Star game. I don't know how they do it anymore. I think now they do it like USA versus the world team. But it's only, you know, the first and second year players. Oh, why don't they just do rookies and sophomores? Like, oh, bye. I don't get it. <coughs> What's up, Pacers fan? everything with you play ya had to deal with an upset stomach today that's no good would you eat <coughs> excuse me drink some water here <coughs> You had a steak last night? Let me guess. Would you have it medium rare? Or maybe rare?
Yeah, medium rare. It was probably closer to the rare side than, than medium rare. Pacers fan. That, that's happened to me before. It's it's not fun. I, I feel for you. I would say, uh, dude, inhale as many Tums as you can. You know what Tums are, right? It's like an antacid. Or you can get, you know, the, uh, the, the, uh, the off-brand version, which would be Equate or whatever. But yeah, get get, get get some of this up in you, man. We, we keep this thing, like, right on deck, because you never know. Ooh, good one, Dug-Eyed. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't want to, you know, kick a man while he's down. But that's hilarious. I think Sixers are going to come out of the East. They look real good. And Ben Simmons still can't shoot a ball. Once that kid can get a respectable jump shot, OMG. Jaron Blossom game for the Spurs to 299 the autograph. Spurs are always picking up like random players and then turning them into solid NBA players. <clears throat> They're like the Miami Heat of the West. And vice versa. Josh Jackson, Suns, die cut. He cut his hair. I used to like him because he had the fro. Fro gang. You know, we got to stick together. Jimmy Butler, the 25. He's in a Bulls uniform, but this one will go to the Timberwolves. Dwayne Bacon is 75 for the Hornets. Drinking 7-Up, really? Does that help you? I guess maybe with the gas? I mean, every everybody is different, so. But i never heard of that one. Actually, you know, when I have, like, an upset stomach or something, I'll, I'll do, like, a, uh, like, a variation of that. I'll drink, like, a Coca-Cola, but with, like, a, with, like, a lime, like, the lime juice. Like, I literally cut a lime in half and squeeze it, squeeze the juice into the Coca-Cola. It, it helps me. But as I approach 30 years old, I'm starting to notice little things have changed for me. Like, I can't eat the same anymore. Yeah, Coke with lime. Yeah, basically. Like, I can't eat the same anymore. I can't even eat... I can't eat the same types of foods anymore without it, like, destroying me. That freaking sucks. Oh, Greg, you already... You already know. You already know. It's funny, I got I got some Bacardi Ch just chilling in the fridge for a uh, for 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 a rainy day, so to speak. All right, let's see what we got. Good luck, everybody, especially those without a hit. See what we can do here. Man, imagine if the Thunder had kept Harden, Russell, and KD on the same team. And Ibaka, too. Oh, my God. They would probably be the Warriors right now on, on steroids. John Collins to 50 Hawks. Dennis Smith Jr. I hope he balls out for the Knicks, man. That kid's a baller. It 
It is it is a sunny day in Miami. It is. Can't complain. DJ Wilson is 75 for the Bucks. Last night, yesterday, it was raining like all day. It was pretty crappy weather uh, by Miami standards was, uh, yesterday. I wonder. I don't watch the news or anything like that. But uh, I hope, you know, Chicago and the Midwest and whatnot aren't dealing with that crazy, crazy cold anymore. Clay to 125 for the Warriors. And that's going to do it for the break. All right. So to recap, we got DJ Wilson Bucks, 75. Blossom Game Spurs, 299. Monk Hornets, 299. Ball Lakers, 299. Bacon Hornets, 75, and a Kevin Durant, base at auto, redemption for the Warriors. Very nice. And that's it for the break. Thank you, everybody. We'll get it out to you.